Good morning, everybody. Today we're going to go over this package we got from Derma E. They are have for this month. They have sent us the into bright and vibrant skin. Um, and to do that, the new vitamin C bestsellers is what they've sold us. We have a cleansing paste, a vitamin C concentrated serum, and some gel eye patches. So today we will be uh, testing all of these out with Jeremy. E. This is what it looks like, the little pamphlet. And then on the back side, it gives us all about the products, each one, what they're going to do for your skin. I personally can vouch for uh, vitamin C. It's something that I've used in my skincare before. Um, and it's really helped with textures of my skin, clearing any acne up, helps with fine lines and brightening. There's so many things that vitamin C can do for you. So anybody who has the same issues that I do, vitamin C is a crucial part. You can use it in one form somewhere. You don't have to put in everything. I have found that serum form was the best form for me. Um, but it's totally up to you and what you like, what works with your skin, what's going to work with your makeup routine daily that kind of a thing so let's jump right into it we're gonna go over what each product does and then we're gonna demonstrate it all for you so we're gonna start with the Derma E vitamin C gentle daily cleansing paste now this is definitely a paste it's definitely a different texture than you're used to and it's definitely a different color um, this is a multi-use cleaner it has golden turmeric and ancient rice works to brighten skin as it cleanses cleanses and exfoliates there is an exfoliant and here are some little beads that are in there to help scrub your skin but the, nothing harsh or anything like that doubles as a mask for face and for your hands that i did not know um but this it's got a i've already used this a few times but definitely got a different color to it definitely has that Homework like smell usually anything with vitamin C has a very citrusy smell to it um, but not this one but I do like that it's a paste which means you don't need as much um, it goes on really easily it really cleans in there I've been using it for three days and nothing I haven't used the serum yet or the eye patches and yes girl yes mm. so this is the cleanse, which I really do like, the cleansing paste that they sent. Next, we have the Derma E Vitamin C Concentrated Serum. This is a top-selling serum formulated with a vegan hyaluronic acid and a 5% level of stabilized vitamin C. Um, knowing the percentage will let you know um, how strong it is and it, how it's going to affect your skin. The strongest I've seen is it to a 30% and that stuff made my skin tingle and itch. I knew it was working. I knew it wasn't being too harsh because it wasn't like I was itchy the next day. So I knew it wasn't an allergic reaction. Um, but I'll let you know that it was working because that stuff was potent and it didn't work well with anything else because it had to be in a, um, a silicone like... Um, like a moisturizer type thing, silicone serum. It was a different substance and it didn't mix well with much everything else. Um, this is used to brighten the skin, boosts collagen health, um, and diminish diminishes the appearance of fine lines, wrinkles, age spots, and even skin tone. Like I said, vitamin C is a multitasker. I mean, we all have all kinds of stuff going on with our skin anyways. We're always worried about brightness. Is our skin dull? Are we lacking anything? Have we gotten enough hydration? Vitamin C is gonna help bring it back to life. You still need a drink, but it's gonna bring it back to life. It's gonna help with the acne. It's gonna help with um, any textures that you have. I used to have texture all over the place and you can see it in every picture. And once I use vitamin C, pff, gone. I promise you, gone. Do I still get breakouts? Sure. And not like I used to. It's all tolerable and manageable for the most part. Minus this. Ignore this. Anyways, um, fine lines for sure helps with fine lines like around my eyes, around my mouth. I'm going to be 35 this year and most people think I'm 25. So this is another thing that's going to help with this type of stuff. The fine lines and the 
uh, light wrinkles and that kind of stuff. I also get some up on my forehead. If you're using consistently on vitamin C, you will see the difference. Night and day. I promise you, night and day. But this is going to help with evening all that out. Skin tone, textures, acne, fine lines. It's just going to give you that real even base. And when we go into working on foundation, you have to have that even base to give you that flawless finish that you're looking for. Whether it's matte, whether it's it's glowing, whether it's a more of a natural look or a real heavy makeup. You have to have that even base to be able to go any direction that you want to. So, and then last but not least, we have these. Are the German E, the Vitamin C Bright Eyes Hydrogel Patches. It has Alan Tone caffeine and vitamin b3 to brighten your eyes which i heard caffeine is great for that it also provides intense hydration um if you're noticing that anything under your skin is getting real wrinkly crepey or kind of has that weird texture when you go and set it hydration 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 i've had those those things happen too um, especially in the winter and if I go in and hydrate it with anything super intense it generally clears it up um, but I have to be vigorous about that routine I have to stick to that routine for a bit just to get everything back to where it should be again you have to be drinking those fluids and last but not least hydrates and awakens tired dull looking eyes so nowadays everybody's on the go we are quick 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 never stopping I know I don't and if I take a break it's because my body's telling me that it's time for bed, girl. So, that is everything that each of these products do. Again, you see the repetition of it's brightening, it's helping your fine lines. I didn't really mention texture in here. I know it helped with my texture. Um, so keep a lookout on that. I had to, I, it wasn't monstrous texture, but it was significantly all over my cheeks all the time. Um, and it really helped with that kind of stuff. But the brightening you will definitely see helping with the fine lines and all the hydration that you're looking for. Um, and this says, our vitamin C line is clinically proven to 82% showed visual improvements in skin radiance and brightness. 91% agreed to strong, agreed to strongly agree that skin felt more hydrated. 97% agreed to strongly agree that appearance of uneven skin tone has improved. And 97% agreed to strongly agree that skin was brightened. So I'm going to go with, with Derma E. I haven't used their specific stuff, but I've used uh, vitamin C before, based products, and game changer for me. That's why I want to make sure that we did a full video on these products so we could talk about my experience um, and what they can do for you. And then I want to make sure that we go through and actually use these bad boys so you guys can see what they look like and what they're doing and all that kind of stuff. So let's go back in. I'm gonna bring back the paste for you. Like I said, this is, it, it's a texture. And this smell isn't really delightful, but it's not painfully awful too. They did a really good job at like um, subduing it, but I think the balance between the two helped as well. Now you can feel the beads in there that are to exfoliate your skin. Like I said, it's thick, but I like that because usually if you get a face wash, you go to put it on, you're like, it's dripping off my face, the water's running everything off, what do I do? I like that this is thicker. I like that you can use it as a mask. I didn't even realize that until I read it, so that's always a good thing to know. You see it, there's a little pink hue. I can't see it in person so much, but I can definitely see it in the camera. But there isn't a lot of the beads to scrub your face, as you can see. Like, you can't. See if I can find it. I don't know if I like a micro bead, or like a little sugar crystal. But I always focus when I exfoliate at my problem areas, which is my nose. Top to my cheeks, around my nose, my chin. There we go. Let that sit on there just for a few minutes. Let's see what it says. How to use concealer. Cleanse, lather over damaged face and neck. Rinse thoroughly with water. 
For mask, apply generously to face, hands, and other skin areas, avoiding eye and lip area. Leave on for three to five minutes or until dry. <clears throat> so you can use it, wash it easily, put it on, lather up. I didn't really lather this since we're sitting in front of the camera. Um, but lather this on, rinse it off. If you want to use it as a mask, it's three to five minutes, really easy, and you can wipe it off and be on the go. Um, or you, you're in the shower, pop it on while you're in the shower waiting as a mask. Let it sit for five minutes, and then, and then you can take it off. Um, that way, you're getting a deeper clean. Um, and masks always feel great right before you do makeup or anything that you're doing a big event that day. Pff, it's nice to have a multitasking cleanser. So I'm just gonna go in. I'm just gonna go in with a cloth and wipe this all off. So before I put the serum on, I want to go ahead and pop on these little eye patches. Now it comes with a little thing to help get them out of the container. Don't lose these little lids. Helps keep everything in there. Helps keep everything saturated and all that stuff. So we're just going to sit here and they're so pretty. They're like a, a, like a gold glitter. There we go. Now this container comes with 30 patches. Uh, 60, just 60 patches, 30 pairs. That's a lot. If you want to do these daily, that's a month. You're going to do them every other day. That's two months. Or if you just want to do them when you feel like you need the extra oomph, that could be much longer than you expect. Now it says to leave these on for 10 minutes. I'm gonna let those sit. Now we're gonna go in with our serum. I'm gonna put a couple of pumps of this on. Mmm, there's that vitamin C smell I was looking for. Kinda smells like Fruit Loops. <laughs> don't judge me, it smells like Fruit Loops, for sure. And I don't like Fruit Loops. The serum feels very um, water-based, which is good. It means it'll probably work with other products really well. Oh, just are so lighting. I think about gel patches is they just wiggle their way everywhere. There we go. Do one more little pump from my forehead because have you seen this thing? Leave these patches on for a few more minutes. It's done our 10 minutes of due diligence of letting these little babies on. It says as long as you want to. So if you're doing makeup, say you're doing brows, eye makeup, want to leave mine a little longer, that's fine too. It'll catch some of that fallout if you're worried about it. But we will take them off. Ooh, yes, girl. Nope. Rub it in. Rub in some of that extra. Never have too much love on your face, let me tell you. All right. All right, and then to top it off, we're going in with Derma East Skin Restore Advanced Peptides and Collagen Moisturizer. Now, I really like this moisturizer, but I can't use a lot of it. it just doesn't sit the best under my makeup, but if I use a small bit, we're good to go. But I just want to put something on my face to seal in everything we've done. Putting this moisturizer on is going to help seal everything in. So it doesn't go anywhere. That's all the deep down under your the surface of your skin products that you need. And the moisturizer is meant for the top layer of your skin. But it seals it all in. I have this fleck of glitter. 
There we go. Gotta do this a big old stop sign up here. There we go. Look at that skin, girl. Woo. Definitely feel brand new. And that stuff feels amazing. That serum, I love that serum too. I'll be using it some more for you guys and doing more post view on Instagram and whatnot. But keep in mind also that Dermy E is GMO free. It is cruelty free. It is vegan friendly. It is gluten free, soy -fee free, and um, they recycle. So keep that type of stuff in mind when you're around shopping. I know a lot of people, these types of things are important to them. Um, so I'm just so glad that I'm on this journey with Jeremy E and we're able to test their products and show it out, show it off to you guys. Again, vitamin C is crucial in my skincare routine. I'm going to be 35 this year. If you guys are having any of the same issues that I'm battling, fine lines, discoloration anywhere, I really don't have too much of that, but I have some, as you guys can see in this area. Um, textures, some acne, not so much the cystic acne where you get the deep ones under your skin, but that surface stuff that helps with. Make sure you're putting vitamin C somewhere in your routine if you can't. You don't need to do all three of these, but at least something. You pick your biggest problem area and you go, I really want to fix this. If it's under the eyes, you feel like you look always tired, just get the patches. You can use them for a full week every day and then start spacing them out if you want to or if you're like nope i want something daily but i don't want the patch idea get the face wash start there face wash is something everybody can do everybody else has a hard time committing to a routine so if you can't commit to a routine start with a face wash and stick to the moisturizer you already have or that you're already using if you do have a routine and you just want to put something else in Put the serum in, put the face wash and the serum. I think those two go really, really well together. Of course, the patches are a great add-on, but they're not always a must. So just keep that in mind. Make sure you're making a routine that is doable. Don't feel like you have to do something that everybody else is doing. Don't feel like because us influencers are everywhere going, do this, grab that. Do what's best for you. Do what is feasible for your routine, for yourself, your skin, your budget. It doesn't always have to break the bank, I promise you. So, but also keep in mind, you shop Dermot E's website, you can go to Ulta um, and shop with them well, as well. Um, Ulta tends to have a sale with buy one, get one 40% off most of the time. That's when I'll grab anything I need to re-up on, um, stuff like that. I know Dermot E's got a great acne line that I've really loved as well. Um, so just keep that kind of stuff in mind when you're shopping around and want to test things out. Again, start with one new product. Give it two weeks to test out on your skin before you're jumping into a mass production of new products that way you know exactly what product is giving you an issue and what isn't if you go buy three products and test them out all at once you can't specifically point out which product is an issue you're gonna have to figure it out and stop all of them and you're gonna feel like you wasted all this money because skincare could be one product could be 50 60 bucks depending on what brand you're getting and what it's doing for you so keep that in mind one product at a time and then add in slowly. If your skin's not having a reaction after a week, jump right in. I know for me, uh, benzoyl peroxide is a no. Within hours, I am swelled up in a tomato and I'm itching from here to, to Tokyo. So it's a no. <laughs> so it makes me having to find other acne regimens a little bit more difficult, but at least I know what's a green light and what's a red light. So keep that in mind when you're doing your routine, one part at a time, and make sure it works for your routine so you're successful. The point is to be successful and see the product work the way it should be. If you can't make a routine for yourself that's going to help you be successful, you're going to waste product, you're going to be frustrated, you're going to be mad with the company and the brand, you're going to be mad with me for giving you all this information, so just keep those types of things in mind. Anyways, I'm done babbling now. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. Thanks so much for hanging out with me, Vitamin C and Derma E. And we will see you guys on our next skincare tutorial or any of our other tutorials. I love you guys. See you soon.